Hi, this is Mike Conaway. I want to talk to you briefly about uh, the Democrats' attempt to take over 17% of our economy using a vehicle called H.R. 3962. Uh, this health care reform bill is uh, 1,900 pages long. I'm holding a copy of it here in my hands. Uh, they've added another amendment to it of another 40 pages, so clearly over 2,000 pages of law that uh, uh, will generate thousands and thousands of additional pages of regulation as they implement this bill. Uh, but I'm against this version of health care takeover uh, by our federal government. Uh, I'm against it for a variety of reasons. Uh, listen to the way this thing sounds when it hits the floor, just to kind of give you a, a sense of what, uh, uh, what I think about it. Uh, I'm against it because their estimates are that it will cost about 5.5 million jobs in this country. It'll result in 114 million people losing their health insurance, their private uh, company-based health insurance. It will cost uh, seven. Excuse me. It will cost over 1.3 trillion dollars in new spending at a point in time when we can't afford the spending we've already committed to. It will raise taxes of about 700. And $29.5 billion uh, at a point in time when our economy needs anything but a tax increase. It will take $500 billion in, in revenue and spending that was otherwise dedicated to Medicare and redirect it into this Democrat's new program. Uh, Medicare trustees have already told us that by 2017, Medicare will be broke. Uh, and so taking uh, 700, or excuse me, $500 billion in new revenue, or in revenue that was otherwise in that uh, plan for the trustees are currently counting on and redirecting it to, uh, to this plan uh, clearly shows you that Medicare uh, benefits will be cut uh, as a result of this bill. Republicans have a better alternative. Our alternative would be targeted, uh, would deal with some things that uh, most all of us agree with, uh, and it's certainly not uh, 2,000 pages. Our bill is about 200 pages. It would deal with medical tort reform, malpractice reform, that uh, the CBO has estimated will, solve, will, will save about $53 billion over 10-year periods. It'll deal with portability. It'll deal with buying insurance across state lines. It'll deal with the very important concerns of pre-existing conditions, which uh, both sides have agreed to, uh, to try to address. Our bill would do those simple, straightforward things that would have a direct impact on the cost of health care and the affordability of health insurance across this land, and in my view, uh, is a much better uh, way to go at this. The Democrats are planning a very limited debate, uh, no amendments other than the one Republican substitute that we've been promised. Uh, we'll have an hour of debate on the rule. We'll have about three hours of debate on 2,000 pages of a, of a bill. And then we'll have hopefully an hour of debate on the Republicans' 200-page bill. Five hours of debate uh, that will encompass uh, changes, uh, dramatic, draconian changes to 17% uh, of our economy. Uh, I'm going to vote against this. Uh, I've told you the reasons why I'm against it. Uh, the one thing I would be for, if the Democrats would agree, and that is to scrap that 2,000-page monstrosity uh, and start over with uh, looking at limited, targeted reforms that Republicans are proposing uh, in our alternative. Last night on a telephone town hall, we uh, had um, posed a question to the folks on the line. Would you vote for uh, H.R. 3962? Would you vote against it? Or do you not yet know your position? 89% of the people on the call said they would vote against uh, H.R. 3962. 5% on the call said they would vote for it. And 6% are saying that they don't yet know their particular position on this deal. But 89% is a very dramatic number uh, from the call that says they are opposed to this, uh, this health care takeover uh, by our federal government. I'm opposed to it as well, and I'm going to continue to work as hard as I can uh, to stop the passage of this bill in the House of Representatives. I need your help. Uh, and look forward to getting your help to, uh, to make this, uh, to try to stop uh, this uh, monstrosity, as I said, uh, from becoming law. Thank you for listening to, uh, to my comments and look forward to talking to you again soon.